Well, you're joining us right here at the Paco Arena and it's still the finals this time around in the men's division of Mantayo. Game one. And uh, we are also excited to bring this match to all of you. Of course, it's UST taking on DLSU in a best of three affair. Benji Santiago, kasama ko pa rin rito si Chiki Pablo. And uh, Chiki, eto, kumbaga, isang well-rested na team ang UST. Eto naman, De La Salle, of course, Parang pang ilang game days na nila ito. Kaya pa ba? Right. Oo nga. <laughs> Nako, uh, De La Salle will have a lot on their hands because ang UST is the number one team in terms of spiking, blocking, setting, and receiving. So, De La Salle has to find a way to go through those blocks to be able to come up with good plays in and out of system. Well, just in case you have just joined us, nakakuha na ng kanilang unang panalo naman kanina. Adela Sal College of St. Benilde at the expense of FEU in straight sets victory. Well, after the mang La Salle, we'll see how they would fare against itong uh, UST. Ayan ang alamin naman natin sa susunod na mga bahagi ng aming uh, patuloy na paghahatid sa inyo na Billy Collegiate Challenge. And it seems like only yesterday when we started this one, nandito yeah. na tayo. So finals, let's talk about De La Salle University Green Spikers. Sino ang dapat natin tutukan dito, Chiki? I think for both teams nga, eh, ang dapat tutukan is yung libero. Kasi uh -huh. yung libero, very crucial yan. So for La Salle, you have, of course, um, their number six na si Guerrero, Maynard Guerrero. He has been doing a fantastic job for La Salle in putting those first balls up. In fact, I think if I'm not mistaken, he's the number one best receiver for the league dito sa men's division. Well, yun ang aabangan natin sa kanya and it seems like he's ready to just bring more of what he can do here for La Salle. Of course, ang USC parang na-miss namin ang UST. Medyo matagal pag nakita natin ulit. And nandito na nga sila sa finals. Oh, kasi they had to wait pa eh kung sinong mananalo between Ateneo and La Salle. And for here naman, ang liberong babantayan natin ay si Van Van um, Prudenciado. Siya din, no? Talagang ito, uh, he doesn't care kung masaktan siya. Basta kukunin niya yung bola. Whether it's in the bleachers, kailangan niyang tumalon over the A-boards, gagawin niya. Yun. And in the meantime, excited na ba kayo? Well, hinay-hinay lang dahil sa ilang sandali sa aming pagbabalik. Game 1 of the finals, UST and La Salle going at it against each other.
Ladies and gentlemen, introducing our officials for this match, our first referee, Erlindo Eusebio, national referee. Our second referee is Herbert Matematico, Asian international referee. Let's call on the starting lineup first for the University of Santo Tomas, Golden Spikers. Outside hitter number one, G-Boy De Vega. Opposite spiker number six, Eman De Doroy. Middle blocker number 10, Rainier Floor. Outside spiker number 13, Josh Ibanez. Middle blocker number 16, Popoy Colinares. And starting setter number 17, Gwen Colinares. Their starting libero is number 18, Van Prudin Shadow. And the head coach for USC is Oji Mamun. Calling on the starters of the De La Salle University Green Spikers. Team captain wearing jersey number one, opposite spiker J.M. Bronquillo. Starting setter number eight, Jin Ponquita. Outside hitter number nine, Noel Compton. Middle blocker number 13, Nat Tulpilar. Middle blocker number 15, Eric Layug. And outside spiker number 17, Vince Maglino. Their starting libero is number six, Maynard Guerrero. And the head coach for La Salle is Jose Roque. Ladies and gentlemen, this is game number one of the best of three series, UST. DLSU for Our the here, para rito nga sa panic ng started. UST Golden Spikers. Hindi lang yung bong UST. Si Coach Oji Mamo na miss din natin eh. Kasi oh. of course, he did his stint naman sa Asian Games as mm -hmm. the coach ng ating uh, national team in the men's division. And uh, timing naman ang pagdating niya, di ba? Perfect. Game one of finals, <laughs> the UST. They were able to take care of business even with his absence. Samantala, ito naman De La Salle. Green Spikers. Ano yung UST? Ang tanong ko sa kanila, rest or rust? Oh, Dahil, ah. diba, it could pa work sila. both ways, Pointing, diba? Eh. Oh, oh. Oh, oh. Ito naman na uh, panig ng De La Salle. Sige lang, sanayin na kami rito kahit araw-araw <laughs> That has been the case for them. Surviving in semi-finals against their arch-rival Ateneo. And uh, ito, tingnan ngayon natin. Ano? Nagsisimula na ito. And here we go with Game 1 of the Finals. And the first point para rito sa panig ng UST is J.M. Ronquillo wanting to be aggressive to get too long for that attack. And here we go naman para rito sa UST. Radio floor with that service. And Noel Campton, very early making his presence known. Yeah, Noel Campton, no? There was no blocker for him during that time. Kaya talagang front line ang bagsak ng bola niya. Well, a lot is truly expected from Noel Campton as we take a look at uh, Poquita right now. For that service. I don't believe he has seen the action dun sa kanilang huling laban against Ateneo. No one can try for the attack that blocked UST point. Yeah, the Colinares brothers saw where the attack was gonna come from. At puinesto na nilang sarili nila, oh. Ayan. Kasi alam nila yung tendency ng palo ni Campton. Napansin pa natin dito sa Lasal. Lahat kaya ka sa bagong dupin. Oo nga eh. Parang eh. Okay. Oh! So this error, the first one of its nature here in this game one of the finals. And now, tied at two very early here with Noel Campton. Minus that uh, headband, uh, talaga na intriga tayo. <laughs> Bagong gupit naman siya, hindi niya na kailangan mag-headband. Correct. As we take a look. Ito na mga ng UST. Dead Roy with such quick arm swing there. Bringing that ball down to Zone 6. 
So if there's any rust for UST, we don't see it very early here in game one of this match. And Josh Ibanez is at the service area. Mantala J. Ambrose Kirio finishing that point with that combination attack ng Lasal. Yeah, ganda kasi naman ng first ball ni Campton eh. Kaya nakagawa ng deception, deceiving play si Pokita. Three all here so far. Good service. And a quick attack by UST. Actually, nung, yes. oh, nung, pa, nung pa set up si Colinares going to his attacker, naka, angat na yung mga kamay niya. You don't really know where he's gonna give that ball to. And then suddenly, he gives it to his brother. Wala pang uh, blockers na naka-establish. Pita with that set. It's Maglina went wide with that attack. He wanted to uh, push that ball to zone one, but it just went wide. Five serving three. Once again, we'd like to tell you, Kanina, sa ating uh, finals din, ng, uh, game one, makauna na. De La Salle College of St. Benil. I don't know if that's any indication of what's going to happen with De La Salle University naman here in this match. The game won the finals. <laughs> Pero ang US, they are very aggressive sila. Ngayong uh, umpisa pa lang with the first few points. And you know that they've already adjusted. Even if wala pa tayo sa 10-point mark. And somehow they have got to show si Coach O.G. Mamon what they were able to progress on while he was still doing his duty for the country yeah, in the Asian sure. Games in China. Wow, Maglina, what a hit! Cross court, walang nagawa floor defense. Kailangan na gumawa na parang yung Maglina, why did it? He's got to make up for it. J.M. Bronquillo at the service area. And it's UST right now. Ooh, that's wide. Dedoroy. Dedoroy wanted to go just behind the blockers, but he just pushed it too wide. Gilid na gilid na siya. Wala na siyang pupuntahan behind pa doon. And then a quick attack naman. Para rito sa panig ng UST. Rainier floor. Yeah, kasi ang UST, they also respect the blockers of LaSalle. So, bibilisan nila yung atake nila para wala pang established blockers. Seven serving five. Tedoroy with that service error. I don't know kung parang nag-feel out set ba ito. At least the early goings for these two teams. Vince Maglina. Six serving seven. That's correct. UST Fox with that set Good dig Oh, it's over And in the line Oh, it's just about to make mention Di pa natin nakikita Na gumana Ito si Josh Ibanez Tapos Yun pa Ang nangyari Nagbigay ng puntos Para sa Lasal And even off here We were talking about Josh Ibanez Like, who really? Have the ability, the capability to control it and see Josh Ibanez. Okay. Unless he commits an error. Yes. They're taking us into our first technical timeout here in set number one of game one of the finals with La Sala, an 8 7 lead against UST.
first match of the men's finals, UST against LaSalle, or better yet, Redemption against Momentum. LaSalle carries over their morale high from the recent reverse sweep in the semifinals, and evidently so, I could hear very loud hype music coming out of their locker room earlier. But that's nothing that the Golden Spikers cannot handle, as Coach Oji Mamon said. Instead of boosting the team's morale, he challenged them. He also said that ultimately this was a test of a mastery of their system. The Dagparon, one of the goal of theirs was to increase the number of core players, and that's exactly what Coach Oji is proud of right now. The four new core players in the rotation, Sherwin Omandal, Noy Colinares, Trevor Valera, and Van Van Prudencia, Benji Chiki. Yun lang. Pero kanina, meron kang naikwento sa amin, Amira, na si Omandal is not going to play here in Game 1. Under the weather then. Uh, every, ang, ang dami talagang tao may sakit ngayon eh. Kaya kailangan. Sargahan nyo ng vitamin C. Oh, dami-dami yan, vitamin C. Well, don't look now, but it's LaSalle on top by two. Time serving seven. And Spaglina once again at the service area. What a good serve. Bobalik with the attack from Josh Ibanez. Wow, ang ganda no, kasi kanina nag-cross court, tapos biglang si De Vega nag-down the line para hindi mo ma-predict kung saan manggagaling yung atake. And look at how that went through the blockers. Napai-split tuloy si Vince Maglil. Trying to dig that. Nevertheless, 8 serving 9. It's on error again. The newest is a service. Yeah. That's Pilar right now. We have this two point advantage here in set number one. Lumo tino nuko kanina si Pokita. Pan ano ba ritual niya? Nag-aasaran daw sila ng teammates niya. Yun na yung ritual. <laughs> well, look at that. Josh Ibanez with three blockers in front of him. Not a problem at all. Yan na yung pinag-uusapan natin oh, with Josh Ibanez. You can, can cry. You can cry. Yeah. And you can pray. Kita <laughs> <laughs> with that set. Canto trying to drop it. Nandun ang UST. Si Banyas! How do you like that? Sumabit pa sa net, nakatulong pa yun. Saka parang na hindi nga maganda yung approach niya dun sa ball eh. Parang natapilok or something like that, no? Pero, and yet, he was still able to bring in the point. Sabi nga nila, iba yung maswerte kaysa sa magaling. Then even the joust right there, USC keeps it in play. Pedroy, blocked. Oh, it's Josh Ibanez short on that attack. And what we're expecting to happen here in game one of the finals between these two teams. Well, you can take a look at the score. 11 serving 10 right now. I excited I knew this was going to be such a match to watch. Pwede ka naman tanghali na gumising dahil second batch tayo. <laughs> second shift. Diba? Diba naman, aral ng aral, prepare ng prepare. Tsaka <laughs> yung dasal mo, kailangan ko yan, GQ. <laughs> Nasagot na kanina sa ating uh, game one and final sa women's. Uh -huh. Imagine that. Three sets na ang kinailangan ng Dela sa College of St. Benito. Take care of business against them. But that was only game one. They will meet again this coming Friday. Yes. And so are these two teams. Pero sabi nga, gan balik na naman tayo doon. Whoever takes care of game one most probably have everything going for them as an advantage. Mm -hmm. Pero knowing FEU kasi, bumabawi yan. Eh. Yep. Ganun din nangyari sa kanila. And the semis. Right. Um, uh, straight to the throat of Gampon. It's all there. Chance again here for USC to grab back the lead 
Oh. oh. Very unlikely yeah. for Josh Ibanez. I agree. That will turn out to be good news for De La Salle, just in case. Good serve. Going with that set. And off the block, needs a point for USC. And that's din to Maloni De Vega. That time his chest was like over the tape. And he's not bad. Pero he was able to tool the blockers that time. It's Boy Colinares. 13 even here in set number one. Quick attack here by De La Salle, not Del Pilar. Getting that point. Ganda nung communication ni Poquito tsaka ni Del Pilar eh. Nagtingin, tinignan lang niya eh si Del Pilar and he knew already when to take off. Those first set that we're seeing here. J.M. Ronquillo to serve, 14-13. Get over that attack. Good dig by Lasal. Nothing much that they can do about that. You know, Pokita, talagang iniikot niya yung bola, no? Hindi lang sa harap, pero pati yung likod, talagang ginu-utilize niya. That's a good quick to the back. Tawag doon, big. Ballpen. Pwede. Pati bali ballpen. <laughs> so, tikit pa rin dito sa ating uh, first set. Serving is Eman Tedoroy. the serve. And service, you can see, by Lasal. Up speed attack by J.M. Ronquillo. And it turns out you're dead. Get it down. His best after scoring that point. Yeah, Colinari is also doing a good job in distributing those sets. Tita mo, nadala din ni ano yan, ng number 10 uh, in front na si Floor. Si Floor. Yung blockers ng Lasal. Kaya na split sila. Even at 15. Over the receiver. Game regalo for USD. And this time, taking us into the second technical timeout. U.S. Tiedemann ngayon na naman, Course, that's why we have the league collegiate challenge because of Mr. Ricky Palu and uh, Eleanor Navarro. Siyempre nga naman. Kanina natapos na pala yung ating uh, bronze medal matches. Ah. Uh, UE sa uh, women's and then sa uh, men's naman ng FEU. There was the awarding that has already happened. Let's alam natin, meron pa tayong mga individual awards to be handed out. Huh? Pretty soon while the uh, finals is ongoing. You know, when Maglino is in front, you have to watch him. Kasi sobra siyang threat at the net. I mean, that attack was such a smart hit. Wiped it off Colinaris' arms. Tied at 16. What else is new? It has been happening here. I think for oh, second Sunday for Vince Maglino. Miscommunication between Ibanez and De Vega. The first ace here in game one and Vince Maglino is the man who was able to do it. And every time he's at the service area, things are really looking good for La Salle. Let's see another good service for Maglino and then that. Quick attack, nandun yung dig and save. 
Oh! oh na nga. Alam mo, inisip na ni Del Pilar eh, if he was gonna go up because that ball was in the free zone on top of the tape. But nagdalawang isip lang siya. Paul Colinares, parang tinangkul. <laughs> oh, that was a smart move there by UST. Every time they go into those quick plays, mm -hmm. no? Yes. It's paying off for them. De Vega at the service area. Guerrero with a pass. UST, kanina sila pupunta. Siyempre, kanina pa ba? Kailangan pa bang itanong yan? Josh Ibanez. You know, the floor defense wasn't for LaSalle wasn't there right away. Eh. Kaya, kasi sobrang bilis ng play ng UST. How many lead changes have actually happened here in just the first set? Naman right. naman ngayon ng UST. No, well, count on naman. Huwag kayong lalayo. Walang bibitaw. And you know, that play was possible because of Maynard Guerrero. He delivered a good first ball. Hindi na tumakbo, naglakad si Poquite. So, medyo gumagawa ng konting ingay si Maynard Guerrero para sa Lasal. Josh Ibanez once again. Ito na. Yeah. Josh Ibanez recognized meron siyang three blockers, pero pinadaan niya yung tira niya sa smallest blocker. Kaya nakapasok yung bola niya. Started off kind of black. Pero eto na. Eto na. Si Josh Ibanez. Pagkakakilala natin sa kanya. Pukita. That push. Ooh, good save. Ronquillo. Josh Ibanez got blocked. Ball still in play here. Good dig by Maglinao. For LaSalle. Camped on! Camped on with an angled hit. Ang ganda rin ng takeoff niya eh. Malayo eh. Outside, you know, far from the attack line. So that also carried weight dun sa uh, trajectory ng bola niya. 19 all. Set one pa lamang ito. Ibanez. Got blocked! Point for Lasao. How many times can you do that against Josh Ibanez? Yeah, you know, when, when the ball is given to Josh Ibanez, talagang siseryosohin mo yung blocking mo. Look at the hands of Lasal, talagang up and over. Walang pupuntahan yung bola. Timeout USC. No, nilagay nyo dun sa kaliwa. Ang blocker ni Josh naka-establish. Lagay nyo dito sa kanan. Ha? At least man lang humabol. Eh, yun lang, katapat na lang eh. Doon na lang sa... Very as a matter of very as a matter of fact, no, yung ano niya, yung si Coach Oji, ang sabi niya na ano eh, um, ang sabi nga niya na ano, uh, <laughs> yung audio lang mo, no? okay, yeah, yeah. ang sinabi nga niya na ano eh. You know, you have, to, you have to watch the defense ng Lasal. Nasaan ba yung blockers? Kung naka-establish na yung blockers sa isang side, doon kayo pumunta sa kabilang side. Kasi kailangan pagalawin mo yung blockers eh, para makalusot yung bola. An all-important timeout and a respond naman ng USC. We tie it all up once again at 20. Home switch na of a set. Bilis, no? Parang kaka-start ng 20 na. Pabor sa atin yan, Chiki. Huwag ka na magreklamo. Huwag ka na magtanong. Good save. Good save. Noel Campton once again. Noel Campton naman. You know, even if his body is diagonally facing the other court, Ano siya, dangerous pa rin kasi nababasa niya yung, ano, yung blockers. Kaya kung papunta pa lang yung blockers doon, nalilihis niya agad yung bola. That's why he went down the line. Remarkable athletic ability yeah. para rito kay Noel Campton. And that's a nice! Wow. Oh, wow. Ka, bata. <laughs> Grabe, it really kissed the corner of zone 5. Uh, zone 1 rather. 
High risk, high reward. Diba, yeah. Chiki? Yun lang yun eh. Exactly. Twenty-two serving twenty. Not a good service by Noel Campton. Boy, Colinaro's good dig by Guerrero. Takes Maglino! What a smart play by Maglino! It was so beautiful to watch. Nakita niya yung established yung blockers and nakatalo na siya. Ano gagawin mo? And he wiped it off. That's exactly what he did. Wiped it off the hands of the blockers. Kinig tayo kay Coach Oji. Ang kamay mo, hindi naka-overreach. Imbis na gano'n, Josh, na nakaporma ka na lang doon, dito ka na lang, ha? Saan papasahin? Ayaw mo na lang. Ayaw mo. Papalo ka open, ha? Labas mo dito. Sabi nga ni Coach Oji, nakataas niya yung kamay, pero kailangan it's over the net. So that walang pupuntahan yung bola. Tsaka yung ganun power. Ang hirap yun, kaya lalamiya-lamiya ka dun. Hindi pwedeng taas lang yung kamay yun eh. Yes, kailangan talaga up and over the net. Yes, oo. The two points away to get the first set here in Game 1 of the Finals. Noel Campton has done a lot of amazing things already here in the first set. Another good serve from him. Ito naman ang UST. No, they won't get the point. It's going to be De La Salle. will be benefiting from that play and UST coming off a timeout pa yan, ha? And we are at set point. Fourth set point advantage here for De La Salle. What a serve. Targado. Nakasave ng set point ng UST. Josh Ibanez, 21 serving 24. J.M. Ronquillo! Cool na cool lang yun, no? Si J.M. Ronquillo. Talagang when he approached that ball, may hang time pa siya eh. He held himself up in the air and then hit that ball when there were no more blockers. So it's De La Salle getting the first set here, 25-21. And with that time remaining, 25 minutes. Ito makikita natin how it all started. Dikit lang tayo eh. Actually, oh, dikit parang, talaga. Sabi ko nga, rest or rust ang tinatanong natin per UST. Oh, pero dun sa latter part, dun sa 20th mark, dun na nag, ano eh, nag-humiwalay ang De La Salle. And also one thing I've noticed here in the first set, they were ready for Josh Ibanez oh, oh. and De La Salle. Yes. Well, let's see what's going to happen. Set number two is coming up.
All right, they uh, na conclude na yung ating first set and it's 25 21 and 25 minutes. La sal ka agad ang nauna laban sa UST Chicky. Yeah, ang ang ano no, ang attack points mas madami ang UST pero mas madami din yung errors nila, 9 as opposed to 2. And I think most of that came from the service zone. Um the aces Yun nga, eh, loaded ang services ng Lasal. Um, I think meron dyan si Campton uh, sa service ace, no? Yes, Pero kung hindi nga, ano, kung hindi ace, talagang they are pushing or talagang forcing ang UST to go out of system. Kaya pag out of system, very, very limited lang ang options ng setter. Yan, narinig ko na naman yung out of system na yan. Yun yung naging uh, problema dun sa ating uh, game one kanina, yes. eh, ng Sa FEU natin narinig yun eh, di ba? Mm, so they're right. down in that uh, series. 0-1, nakauna nga. And De La Salle, College of St. Benil. Nakauna naman dito sa match na to, sa game 1, sa first set, ang De La Salle mm -hmm. University. Yes, and look who's back, Yambao. Oh, wow. Yes. Let's see if we can really help out ang cost ng UST here. Well, you need all the artillery that you can have because this is already the finals and UST. And look at that first setup of Yambao and the block and the hit of floor goes inside the block. Let's see if it could turn out to be what they need him for this manamakabawi di to the second set. And man, oh man. You know, you can't have just one blocker for Ronquillo. Uh -oh. Kasi masyado malaki yung playground na binibigay sa kanya kung isa lang ang blocker niya. He can even do it from the back row, sa yeah. front row. Well, Campton to serve. One set to nothing lead for De La Salle. And that's a service error. The end of days back in the first set. So, if you're not here, I'm bowing. Quick attack to Sagoin and De La Salle. Ready in UST. Just a push and a tip. And De Duroy, the block. Attack you late. Oh, my bad. Good job for the blockers of UST. No, they established themselves, so nagdalawang isip dun si ano maglinaw. Maglinaw. Oh, oh, kaya na late yung pasok ng ano niya, bola niya, mababa na when it went in. That's why it hit the net. Three one. Oh wow! And an ace, Papa Rayambao. Usually, talaga pag center magaling sa service. Eh. Hindi lang, hindi nga ginamit yun for set eh. Coach OG and then all of a sudden, okay, since you're back, you might as well play. Ayan na. <laughs> and he is showing up the stuff that he can do here. Pokita with that set by Glenow. It's going to be a point for De La Salle. Is there going to be a challenge here? A lot of yeah. questions going on. So, UST side. Yes, there's going to be a challenge and it's going to be a block touch. Kasi ang sinasabi ng players ng UST, nobody touched the ball. Pero sinabi ng ating line judge, somebody touched the ball. And this is the first challenge, ha? Huh? Yes, for the final. Second set na tayo. Mm -hmm. Actually, we are expecting a lot of challenges. Yeah, they'll be, we are expecting also some tough and close matches to happen here in the finals. Let's see here. The moment of truth. <laughs> anyway, yes, there was. Okay. Sometimes din kasi sa sobrang bilis, pag ikaw yung player, hindi mo nararamdaman uh, eh, no? Uh, That's why it's good that we have this challenge system. Sa lakas ng mga palo na yan, kahit yes. yung hangin lang nararamdaman eh. Hindi, hindi na nila ma-distinguish kung gumawa ka sila sa bola o hindi. Boy, Sabi ni Poy Culinares, hindi kami. Bawiin na lang. Bigay ng ganyan, ganyan lang. 
Josh Ibanez, five serving two here in the second set. Not exactly impactful the first set. Maybe Josh Ibanez for you and Steve. Del Pilar going for the quick play. Yeah, Del Pilar just dumping that ball towards the setter, Kayambao, because you take out the setter, limited the attack. Taking a look at J.M. Bronquillo. Three serving five. The Vega with that receive. Quick play then. Para kay Poy Colinas. Yeah, ang ganda naman ng one-handed set there by Yambao. Not a problem. Over-receive. Yambao's there to save that ball. Yung value ng Yambao eh, no? Cool din siya when he sets up eh. Expressionless. Yeah, also. Poker face ang dating eh. Ooh, good up! Kaya pa ba? Kaya yan! Kaya talaga, indeed! Guerrero, Poquita, try to 1-2 play, got blocked! Maglina going back throw! You know, si Maglina, ang taas ng volleyball IQ niya. Kasi nakita na niya yun, padating na yung mga blockers, ayan na, so what's he gonna do? He's just gonna push it. Tatlo pa nga yung blockers, eh, diba? Kasi yung tendency niya normally is to go cross-court. But recognizing the blockers, he went for the down the line. Well, they're still down two here in the second set. Yamba with a nice setup right there for you, Stephen and Lasalle. I think that went wide. It's out. Dikit na naman ang Lasal. Real good service to Vega. And that block and a point for De La Sal. Yeah, they knew the attack was going to come from Dedoroy. They were so well established there. Walang pwedeng puntahan yung bola. Umabot na. Tied at six here in set number two. Serve again. And Maglina, then Vega. Good dig by Maglina. Guerrero. Tanto got blocked. And JM went long with that. You know, good defense ang dinalaro ng UST ngayon. They're recognizing the key hitters for, ano, for La Salle. And they are establishing their blocks. Dami nila time kasi para mag-scout. Kita. Nice. And then that drop by Jam Rompilla. Power needed that time of that attack. Oh, kasi akala mo titirahin niya ng malakas yun eh. That's why bumaba yung ano, yung mga, yung floor defense. And so, that created a big hole in front. As close as it can get, seven all. Del Pilar serves it wide. And going into a first technical timeout here in the second set. It's USC just up by one eight seven. Set number two and the game stays as close as it can get. The green spikers are not only exhilarated, 
because they made it this far to the finals, but even more so because this is the first time that this specific team made it this far. Coach Arnold Lanyog said that half of the team members were pandemic recruits at dahil sa mga pinagdaanan nila ng semifinals, finally, nabuo na raw sila at mas lumalim ang connection nila sa isa't isa. Ika nga ni Coach, kaya na nilang mag-submit sa isa't isa kahit sino pang ipasok. Benji, Chiki? Well, thank you very much for that report. In the meantime, happy birthday to Mr. Carlo De La Peña, D-League Event Manager. Happy birthday! Ayan. So, ano ba na, sir? Huh? <laughs> Hope so you have a great you. day, sir. <laughs> yes, truly, indeed. Timing for final spawn. Special occasion. Anyway, eight all. Tayo ngayon. Good serve by Box. <laughs> Did a quick lay. You know what I'm gonna do? Yam bow with that one two. Yeah, normally because he's gonna save the yeah, second ball, de ba? But that time he went for a quick dump. Yan pala, Mr. Carlo De La Peña on your screen right now. V League event manager. Happy birthday. Yon pala siya. Let's see, there's going to be a challenge in that sequence right there. I think LaSalle is asking for a block touch. Oh no, net, net touch, touch rather. And we all await. Mm -hmm. Especially in a close match like this. I mean, getting the point or losing a point. Oh, big up there. Ooh, I don't think I'm Oh, you think I'm going to Challenge is unsuccessful. Point goes to USD. Here we go. Challenge to the leader of the back. Ball in and ball or ball out. Yeah, yeah. Sa harap kasi ni Coach Oji ng yari. Oh, eh. naman. <laughs> Wala naman jet lag kung galing lang ng China, you know? <laughs> Okay. You know, sometimes kasi sa sobrang bilis din, di ba? You can't, hindi mo nakakatch kung in or out ba that's yung right. bola. So if any part of the ball hits the line, that's considered inside. So let's see here. Ooh. Super close. Yes. Kapuhok. Pero it's out. USD is ahead right now by three. Lord with that good service. Cheyenne. And it went to Noel. He got blocked. Noel, the drop. And then USD. Josh also doing the drop. Anything you can do. Siguro yun na sinasabi niya to Lasal. Si Josh kasi, yung pag-approach niya sa bola, akala mo, he's gonna hit that high, eh? And then, suddenly, he decides in mid-air na off the, off, uh, off speed hit. Time out, Lasal. Okay. Tapos, magkapasa, ah, uh, dalawa? Dalawa, tat tatlo tayo? Gulo mo, gulo mo siya. Noel, dito ka, M. Ha? Yung ano natin, play natin na B-Quick na, Dulo, tapos Noel. Alam, lamang ka dyan. Uh, uh, pag may sumabay dyan, upaka mo agad. Go, go, go! Di mo kayo sumabay dyan. Isa lang, isa lang! Kaya na salo, dili, one, two, three! Isa! How do you make that out, Chiki? Yeah. So, may upakan na ako narinig eh. <laughs> yun ang yun ang intindihan natin. Hindi. So, ang sabi nga ni Coach Joe, eh, he really called for fast plays. Um, it all depends on the first ball. And we also heard see Noel Campton, of course, 
uh, to be given that ball. So, tingnan natin kung sa kanya nga ba ibibigay. Sa kanya! Sa kanya talaga! Yes! At nagawa yung play na sinabi ni Coach Joe. Yes! Following the instructions to the hilt. Yeah. Look at that. Oh. Nadala yeah. kasi ng first jumper eh. Yung ano, blocker. Kaya, ang ganda na nung ano, nung maganda para sa Lasal yung net defense na natira. Ng UST. Nine serving 12. Guerrero puts it up. Oh, lifting. Lifting. Violation called on Pakita. Most. Those kind of calls naman talaga usually this is set. Oo. Tsaka kabisado ng referee yan. Oo. Oh. Yun lang. Namigay din ang puntos. Si Yang Bao. Ten serving thirteen. Eric Layug. Or Paulo Layug. Inside. That was a good block by Maglino and Del Pilar. Well, that's the thing. They have a mission here. Try to control and stop. And to see Josh Ibanez, and so far they have been successful. But to consider that si Josh Ibanez is not exactly something kong, as impactful the way we are so used to him. Lamang pangari to ang UST. At patuloy silang lalamang dito dahil sabi ni Josh Ibanez, Impact ba ang gusto mo, Benji? Okay, why not? <laughs> yeah, he got that score. Hindi ganun kalakas yung palo niya. He really just tooled the block there. Yeah. He's a very, very valuable player here yeah. para sa UST. He's got to do what we are so used to him doing here for UST. Nice set. Tedega! Yeah. Para sa UST. Yun nga yung sinasabi ng mga international coaches eh. Yung, yung pace ng team mo, not necessarily you get it from fast plays. Gaya niyan, ayan uh -huh. o, oh, yung kay De Vega. Mataas siya, pero it put him in a really good position. Nakapin yung target ko niya yung kamay ng mga blockers. Good dig by Provenciano. Yan Bao. G-Boy again. See here, Paquita going cross-court. Vince wanting to the cross-court attack. Point will go USD's way. And we get into the second technical timeout here in set number two with USD up five. Back here as we continue with game one of the finals of the men's division. Who's going to draw first blood? But USD right now, they may be down by a set. But they still they have a five-point advantage here. Laban Salasal. G-Boy has got to make up for a lot of things here. He's got to be more aggressive. And so is Josh Ibanez. The star player of UST with a good serve right there. The quick attack, not Del Pilar for La Salle. You know, again, the good of the connection between Poquita and Del Pilar. I mean, Poquita just puts him in a really good spot. The good of the height, the good of the distance from the net. JM at the service area. Yambao, G-Boy, goes cross score, USD wins the point. Beautifully done by De Vega. I mean, look at that wrist action. That was the one that killed them. 
Umaangat pa lang yung blockers. Nakataw niya. Naupakan na. Oh. <laughs> We're just having a wing ding of the time. Bring to you this action. Here in Sapapo Arena. Really collegiate challenge not in finals game one of the men's. It's a race for USC. Kanina, ang loaded services were coming from De La Salle. Now, USC is also making it very hard for La Salle to run their place. Napagpag na yata yung kalawang, Chiki. Ito na sila, ang USC. Boy with a good serve. Baba. Oh, but nice to done by Del Pilar. Diyan mo malalaman kung magaling na hitter yung binigyan mo ng bola. Tumalun ka agad si Flory. Pababa na siya. I love itong Telesal community, USC community here. Yeah. Asensya na kayo. Dalawa kasi yung players eh, from La Salle who looked at each other, eh, ang taas nung bola. So when it landed on the floor, you know, a lot were surprised na it went that way. And I was just about to say, the ingay na narinig natin dito eh. We got a good size of a crowd here inside Baco Arena. Truly talagang finals atmosphere. In the meantime, G-Boy going to score good dig by Guerrero for La Salle. See how this one would go. Yambao, where the suck? Josh. <laughs> wow, Josh. Quiet, quiet, and then boom. Oh, yeah. That's what we got to the body language. I'm going to have to keep playing full and swag with Josh Ibanez. Time out, Lasan. Huh? Hindi tayo prepare, kumbaga, ganyan lang yan, kaya ka nagkulat, hindi ganda. Hindi lang naman yun eh. Siglang para sila. Pinalayo natin ang todo-todo, gawa natin ang paraan. O paano natin gagawang paraan yan? Kontrolin natin yung bola. Di ba? Face natin, face natin. Ang nangyayari, nagpaubaya na tayo eh. Balik ka, balik. Uy! Hindi na tayo nag-iisip. Hindi tayo nagtutulungan. Hindi tayo nag-uusap. Tara! Hey, let's go, 2-3! 1-2-3! That communication factor again being mentioned by Coach Shaw. Yeah. You see Encarnacion, the setter, the second setter uh -huh. of Lasalle. He also came in there in their last match against Lasalle. Yes, Atene. he did. Yep. He produced. Ganda the mga sets niya, nabigyan niya ng pagkakataon yung mga attackers niya to earn the point for their team. So let's see if he'll be able to do the same now. He was given enough confidence because they were able to finish the job now against Atene in only three sets. Eh, no? Pero, that went long for that attack by UST. See, you try to get them ready for the next one. This is the most important thing. Finals now. They're here. So, Nat is at the service area. 14 serving 20. They're going to be doing their very best to climb back here. Pero Rainier floor with a quick attack. Yeah, if you got a good first ball, dun kasi parang sinalulang ni ano eh, ni Yambao yung bola eh, didn't move. So it was perfect for floor. Halos tinaas lang niya yung bola eh. UST right now, basically, with some heads up play. Sayang si Nati Pilar. Service error naman for G-Boy. Sabi nga ni Coach Joe Harina sa La Salle, pinalayo niya yung lead, so anong gagawin? They one point at a time. And right, that's exactly what they're doing. Pero ngayon eh, parang kailangan mong kailangan mo na hagdan para umakyat. Six point disadvantage ng De La Salle. Tingnan natin. Yan ba? Oh! Perfect setup for that Rainer Floor attack. Ayun, nakita ko na nag-smile si Yambao. Because, you know, whenever he sets up that ball, very serious yung face niya. And then, he was happy with that play. Bagaya lang yun, binawi ka agad eh. Yung ngiti, eto, eto. 
And Bell again. Josh Ibanez. <laughs> You know, Papita was there for the coverage, pero yung bola lang niya, hindi masyadong mataas. Kaya nahirapan yung teammates to uh, uh, keep the ball in play. Nasanay sila, nahataw talaga pagka si Josh yeah. Ibanez ang aatake. Pero you can't nga eh, kasi si Josh, ang dami niyang ano eh, different styles of hitting. So, he applies which is best. Ay, ganun din. Ito si Noel Campton para sa De La Salle. Pero somehow that went haywire. And don't look now, but UST take themselves and trying to make a comeback here in this game one finals. Several match points lead here. So one point, one match point saved rather by JM Bronquillo. You know, when the ball goes to Ronquillo, chances are puntos para sa team niya. Kaya malakas yung loob ni Poquita na ibigay sa kanya, especially when it's crucial. Josh Ibanez, Paula Bumanek on their side. Big shadow. Abba. Jam, kabak. It's gonna be a point for UST. And we're all tied up here in game one of the finals. One set apiece. Look at that block. Nahabul pa talaga ni Josh Ibanez yung bola. Kaya sabi nga natin, Josh Ibanez just being himself right now. At eto nga, nakabawi ang UST. 25-16 in set number two. Yeah, UST was faster. Yung bow was a big... Uh, ang ganda ng hugot, di ba? Kay Yambaw, when he came in, talagang things na ayos, na ayos yung, ano, yung laro nila. Nagkaroon ng direction, nagkaroon ng rhythm, and the players were able to deliver. Just when they thought they might have the momentum, La Sala after taking the first set, UST managing a bounce back here, Josh Ibanez. Yes, he's definitely here. And after two sets, we're going to be returning with set number three here in game one of the finals. It's UST this time in set number two, 25-16 against Nassau. The numbers here, Chiki. Yeah, UST controlled their errors. They only had five in that set. At ang attacks nila mas madami because they were able to be consistent in their serve receive so that Yambao was able to just put the ball up for the middles. Uh, yung blocking, Lasal was more in that area by just one point. Service aces, this time around, UST naman ang dalawa. Zero naman ang Lasal. So talagang linuload up na nila ang kanilang uh, attacks, ang kanilang, you know, the attacks e coming from the front line, coming from the back line, coming from the service zone. Well, tingnan natin kung paano naman ang mga magaganap sa ating set number three. And uh, it's like all ages nandirito ngayon. Oh, oh, we have a good crowd. Yep. And why not? Because this is game one of the finals. And these are basically two of the most loved teams in the men's division. 
And they have shown us what they can do reaching this stage of the tournament. And getting the first point here is La Sala after that service error on UST. Yambao is still the setter for UST in this third set. Pero parang na outplay siya rito, ah. Si Poquita, ni Yambao, especially in that set number two. Guerrero. JM gets the corner. That's it, in. Yeah, it's sabi nga, di ba? Yung tira ni JM, hindi siya ganun kalakas, pero mahaba. And that delivered the deception. Akala nila, akala ng UST outside. To Daniel start here. Para sa panig na De La Salle. Kita, back set. Oh, JM again responding. And just like that, there it's three to nothing. Wow, pa iba ibang ihip ng hangin dito sa loob ng Paco Arena. <laughs> Kaya madaming may sakit eh. <laughs> USC still trying to get their first point here. And they did. That was it. Josh Ibanez. And again, Josh Ibanez. Not much of strength in that hit. But the placement was perfect. Zone one. No one was home. We can still find those open spots. Unguarded spots. That's how good he is. Quick attack naman, delivered here by De La Salle. Akala mo kasi, bibigay ni Pukita sa si K. Campton eh, sa outside hit, but then, hindi pala. Mahaba rin ito si Paolo Layug. So when you give him that kind of an opportunity, he'll really go for it. Four serving one. We're all even in this match. One set apiece. Cargada service. My Campton, Josh with that attack. Boy calling Alas. Wow, that was a fast play. Si Culinaris Bayon, it sure oh, was him. Grabe, yes. one blocker will not be able to stop Culinaris. So I just noticed it's yellow and green Christmas na nga. <laughs> <laughs> Yellow and red on Christmas. Sige, simulan na rin ito sa Paco Arena. It's just so very colorful. At saka yung ano nga, sabi ko nga, yung mood dito sa loob. Oh, don't look now. Mendoza is in for Maglinaw. Mendoza did not see action in the last game, right? I think for about a couple of already three games na nila, ha? Yung yung Mendoza. And here he is, and he gets blocked. Malamig ang pasok. Oh, tsaka bantay. Bantay na bantay uh -huh. ng, ano, ng defense ng UST, yung play ng Lasal. Parang nabasa ka agad din. Uh -huh. Ah, atake ka agad to. Habla tayo, four. Infraction of De La Salle. Yeah, that was an illegal attack because Captain stepped on the Ay, line. Uh -huh. he's, a, he's a back row player. When you're a back row player, hindi mo pwedeng tapakan yung line and your attack has to come from behind the attack line. Ito naman si Jem Rokilo. Nasa harap talaga ako. I have all the right <laughs> to do this. There's that good set there. And you see what Pokita did, no? Brinate niya yung blockers ng UST. Kaya madaling nakapasok yung bola ni JM. Ito na Josh Ibanez. Josh Ibanez recognizing, hey, no blocker. Why not hammer it in? And that's what he did. The in at the end. Six serving five. And then an ace for Josh. Ambilis ng ano ng bola ni Josh sa attack line. Ambilis ng bola ni Josh from the service zone.
It's another good serve by Josh. Good day, oh, good receive. Ooh. What a block! But to mama sa antenna. Good guy. Somehow getting the break. Etong Lasal. And UST with Poi Colinales making that happen. They lead by two, going into this technical timeout. Set three. During the preliminary matches, the Golden Spikers' goal was to get the first win in their first ever match and coincidentally, that match was against La Salle. They lost and that being the only blemish in their record, the team gained more fire to win the rest of the games including this one. From those experiences, sabi ni Popoy Colinares na nagbago at nagmature sila kung paano nila tignan ang kalaban nila. Supplementing this, G-Boy De Vega said that any other team's morale and performance should have nothing to do with their team's confidence. At ang sabi ng dalawa, everyone stays ready dahil lagi silang may bala. Benji, Chiki. Aba, meron pa palang ibasang factor to consider for UST. A payback. Oo nga. Babat sa Lasal. Ah! Preliminaries pa nga naman yun. Ito yung yung Mendoza! Wow, you think, no? Medyo malamig pa si Mendoza, pero nope, not at all. I mean, the blocker was there, and then he was not. Na-split eh, yung blocker. If I'm not mistaken, he is a rookie. I'm just surprised nga, a few games that he did not see action. Oo. He's 18 years old. I know. <laughs> and he's being utilized right now here in the finals. Right. G Boy De Vega. If the long balls work for LaSalle, it also works for USD. With a good recognition right there. Detroit. <laughs> Nine seven. And Bowie got set. Canelo with the dig. No welcome. Oh, the dig. That was short. Yeah, he, was, uh, he wasn't in the right position that time, so he tried to make something out of it. He just went short. So he's clean. He's on the bus. He's malapit pang asya sa atin. He was trying to go for that cross court. Oh. And you know, right now, no, talagang yung momentum has shifted to a UST, and they are controlling this match. And the timeout has been called here by De La Salle. Let's listen in. Siya ako talo. Hindi ba pasok yung pressure? Ano? Kita ng kita naman. Kita ng kita. Ba pasok pressure? Pero kailangan natin para gain yun. Okay? Tiga, tutok. Wala kayo ibang intindihin kundi yung team nyo lang. Kung anong gagawin ng kalaban, kung anong gagawin natin, mag-uusap tayo agad. Okay, anong nangyayari kayo? Nakatuto kayo pero wala kayo napapansin eh. Lang ko, tumuto kayo, bawat isa. Tulong-tulong. Ha? Tara, tara. Kawin natin, kaya kaya nyo yun. Kaya kaya nyo yun. Sometimes talaga nangyayari yun eh, no? When you're in the court, you're concentrating but you're not. Yep. Yun yung nangyayari, sabi ni Coach Joe eh, na lahat kayo nakatingin pero walang nakikita. So, they have to talk to each other, they have to get in each other involved in the game, so whether it's reception or attack or defense. 
He returned into the action there. It's Della Sal responding very well after yeah. that timeout. And Matt Del Pilar willing to be the man there to get a point for the Green Spikers. Pero nagahabol pa rin sila rito. 8-11. Set number three, folks. G-Boy, finishing that point for USC. Oh, Poquita's down. I hope he's okay. He bandaged na yung ano niya. Yung paa niya. Oh, but I think it's the other foot. He's, I think he's okay. Yeah, he's okay. Oh, yeah. He's like a smile. He's like a smile. He's like He's having some problems with his knee. Tapos there was one match. He's like a smile. 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 But he's still here. Oh, he's like a smile. Finals na ito. One set apiece, by the way, folks. Tabla tayo in this match. Pero lamang ang UST against La Salle here in the third set. The receive. What a push. Back-to-back -back points by Rompilio. Kailangan gumana siya. Ang medyo tahimik kasi si Noel Campton right now to La Salle. Ayan, no? Look at J.M. Ronquillo, the way he hangs in mid-air. Yeah, he does have the hand time. And a service error. Can't afford to be making a lot of those kind of mistakes. Oh, especially when you're the one running after his demand. It's already the fourth error here in this set for La Salle. USC only has two. JM goes for it. Good coverage. Echo saying you're Joshy Barnes. And you know, that only happened because they really had a good coverage. They kept the ball in play, and Joshy Barnes was given center stage because of it. Sabi mo ba, Campton? Tumahimik eh. Ngayon eh. Ngayon ulit. Dapat eh. Dapat lang. Nagahabol pa sila rito. We just have to contribute. Hindi kaya na nagpagupit na bawasan yung lakas. Hindi naman. Samson. Samson. That's a point. Well, Lasalle. Yeah, they have a challenge. They have a challenge. Uh -oh. yeah. Ang sabi ni Layug, wala. He didn't touch it. Ang sabi ng UST, merong block touch. And that's what we're here to find out. Kaminsan, yung mga ganong calls, if it goes your way, parang game changer eh. Mm. It's either kung lamang ka o nagahabol ka. Well, welcome to game one of the finals in the men's. Here we go. Block touch. Wow. Voila. 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 The velocity of uh -oh. the ball. Eh? So, in direction. Uh -huh. uh, sure, na sure, sila yung bunin na talagang hindi daw niya nahawakan. So, point goes to that. A sound inching closer. 12 serving 14. The sound G boy the Vega. On that attack, it gets the point for the Golden Spikers. You want graceful ni ano, De Vega when he goes up for those hits from the back row. Well, siguro credit that dun sa set na binigay yes, sa kanya. Yes, Iambao. 
Gives him bow. Service area. What? Yeah, what an eye by Colinares. Ang binantayan niya si Poquita. Kaya alam niya kung saan pupunta yung attack. Ay, saan pupunta yung set. He was there for the attack. USC ahead. Coming, going, rather, into the second timeout. Dealing collegiate challenge when it all started, but we're just about to finish the season. Season 15. Basically, hindi lang natin alam kung uh, baka sa susunod na game day, okay na tayo, or may extend pa all the way till Sunday. Nevertheless, kayong mga subusubaybay, kayo ang nagwagi. <laughs> Sulit ang mga finals oh, natin, ha? Oo, ng game. Well, J.M. Bronquillo, what else was he going to do that time? Score! Get a point! For La Salle. And now, Eric. At the service area. Wow! Oh, ng net. It's an ace! <laughs> Siguri yung puso ni Layog. Uy, buti na lang! The net was his friend that time. Sabi ka nga, iba yung swerte. Iba rin yung magaling. Oo. The first ace of La Salle. Here in set number three. Figueroa, nowhere to go. La Salle will get the point. Very well read by the blockers of La Salle. They knew that that set was going to go to uh, the outside hitter. Out of system. Kita kita nila eh. Bumay buelo eh. USD. Dalawang sunod ng La Salle. Ito na naman ang USD. Hanggang dun lang kayo. Ganda ng control ni Yambao eh. Sa bola, again, it was an out of system. He had to run after that ball. Pero he perfectly was still able to give it to Colinares in the middle. Silent operator. Ito si Yambao. Oh! I guess Josh wanted a controlled serve to zone 4. It just went short. Nevertheless, Lasalle is just trailing by a point here. Combination play. G-Boy again. Yes. a USC. A good call there by Yambao on that play. It split the blockers of Lasalle. Point Colinares right now at the service area. 18-16. Guerrero with that receive. Royal Mendoza going cross court. And he's rewarding his coach for giving him the confidence. Kamitin mo na ako, coach. Oops, Pedro Maglino is coming in for... For Mendoza. Oh, medyo mahaba-haba rin na uh, hindi nakabalik itong si Vince Maglino. You know, Maglino din kasi magaling siya sa back row eh, sa reception. Ken La Salta. Or can USD still continue the lead? G-Boy. Good dig. Camp is blocked. 
Kopita going back to Hamdong. There was a touch. Even if the ball went out, there was a block touch. Tied at 18. Time up. Being called by UST. You know, I think that break was really, the time break is, was really just to stop the momentum of Lasalle. Pwede, pwede yan. Kasi nga, inabuta na sila eh. Oo. Kasi ano lang is, very, very simple reminders, no, talking to Yung Bao, na huwag niyang mamadaliin yung sets niya kasi bumababa. So, go for those higher, higher sets kasi nga nababasa naman ng, ano, ng Lasalle. It's served by Benz. Chachibagis. So, yun nga, momentum stopper and then they get the point. Labang buli ang UST. Just went long. Service error. Five errors of UST. Four. De La Salle. Serve specialist Gloria is in for Del Pilar. Good service. Could have been an ace. Buhay pa, buhay pa. They're not going to put on the UST. Go well, Captain. Now they're on top by one. And you know, that's the reason why Gloria was brought in. Napahirapan niya yung floor defense ng UST. Anything could still happen in the close third set. That's what we're seeing from these two teams. Eto naman ako, G-Boy with Beck and Abound! Again, no, nadadala ng... Yung mga tinatawag na plays ni Embao, naluloko niya yung mga yung net defense ng, ano eh, ng Lasal. Kaya nasisplit yung defense at the net. It makes it easier for UST to bring in the ball and find the floor. Hindi mo basa yung facial expression niya. Wala ngang expression. Hindi mo lang ko kanina niya ibibigay eh. Yun na. Service error. Good Lasal. Of course, very appreciative of Lasal community here at Paco Arena. Any point that they can get. At saka the most important thing is to lead in this match. Tabla tayo rito. One set apiece. Yeah. Home stretch of a set. Unahan na naman ito. 21-20. Quick attack floor. Pero the defense is right there for LaSalle. And then oh. drop! What a smart move by Ronquillo. Look at how he walks, though. No? Very cool. Cool comment collected. Hindi ko titirahin ito ng malakas. Pababa na yung blockers eh. Doon ko na lang ipapasok. It's just his duty. And it's job. Time out UST. Hindi ba alisana kung ano eh. Naka-overage na kayong ganyan. Kahit anong patsik na gawin niya. Wala. Di ba ako solid to? Eh ni, yung sinosop lang kung gusto niyong bitawan, di saan nila kayo tumalun? Hey, dalawa! Dalawa! Kape! 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 Hey, dalawa! Ayun na naman yung nire-remind ni Coach Oji on how to come up with a block. Yeah, because you have to be as aggressive and as explosive on the block also. Hindi pwedeng 
uh, mahina yung block mo kasi magaling magbasa ang lasal. Well, in this contest, just in case you missed out the early part, Lasal took set number one, UST Bomawi in set number two. Lasal now leads by two, just three points away to get ahead in this match. And Josh is blocked. It's another point for Lasal. Wow, yung talon ng Lasal was well timed. They knew when Josh was gonna come in for that hit. Double substitution here for USD. Balik si Colinares, pahinga muna si Yambao. Ang tatat is also inside. Ayan, paid off the man. Oh, oh. Floor found the floor. Oh, the floor. <laughs> yes. Three set points for La Salle. That was a lost opportunity for UST, but that's an advantage for La Salle. So no one comes on serving for the set. Serve. Chasubanyas. Good dig by Maglino. Cheyenne Ronquillo. And they have a two set to one advantage here. Yeah, you know what? Rinispeto ni Ronquillo yung habol ni Maglino. Eh. Kasi yung hab, ang layo ng hinabol ni Maglino. It almost, he almost in fact hit our table, right? So when he put that in, that was for his teammate. <laughs> Almost 70% no set number three na. I think controlado yun ng USC. Yes. And then they turn things around and La Salle to lead 2-1. 25 21 as they won set number three. Maganda simula ng USC rito. Everybody yeah. was getting into the act. Yeah. JM Ronquillo has got to be involved. Oh, yung puntos nga nila, di ba? 1 2 1 2. Ganun lang eh. Uh, a step behind, a step advanced. Ganun lang sila, but wow, Lasal kept their cool. Uh, ang ganda ng mga timeouts din na tinawag ni Coach Joe. And they meant business. Set number four is coming up. Don't go away. Well, Lasalle had to go the extra mile. They were playing catch up, and finally they were able to take this third set, 25 21, and lead two set to one against UST. Yeah, the story of that third set was really the errors. Because not much in the attacks, in the blocks, in the aces, the errors. Ayan, no. Jan mo nakuha, nakikita yung discrepancy. Ayun, not being able to uh, really come out strong until the very end. Pero dito nga. 
You can never say what's going to happen next. Yeah. Nakikita niyo naman yung reaction. Yung mga nakadilaw, yung mga nakaberde. Hindi ko alam yung iba ang kulay. <laughs> They're just simply enjoying everything that's happening here. Why not? This is the finals already. Yeah. This is a best of three affair. And of course, this is just game one. So if you're ready, we are ready. Festive atmosphere dito sa loob ng Paco Arena. Kaya pala parang medyo mang nabawasan yung lamig ng konti. Marami kasing tao, you no? Know? Alam natin, malamig na malamig dito, di ba? Si Paco. Anyways, ito na ang ating fourth set. J.M. Ronquilly was the one who finished the job there for La Salle. In set number three, we got a long rally that's happening here. This is not exactly as usual as it can get, especially some men's. Good dig by Yambao is back on the floor here for USD. And then Josh Ibanez, I mean, enough of the long rally. Yeah, you know, Josh Ibanez, ang bilis ng bola niya, it, there was a seam in between the blockers. Kaya dun lumusot yung bola. Rainier floor. Good serve. And Bao went for it, and they'll get the point. Illegal block there by Pokita. Kasi nga, um, back row hitter. I, I mean, back row player. Uh, you're not allowed to jump when you're in front. You're not allowed to go for those blocks. Oh. Enough. And Lasal nargaluhan ng point. It's going to be their first here in set number four. Yung errors, the uh, disparity, the yes. you know, uh, big factor That's against right. UST in set number three. So they got to be knowing uh, better. Uh, speaking of errors, a <laughs> solid that service error. Buhay. Indeed. Ito pa. Buhay pa rin. Josh tried to go back row, but it went long. Oh, may halong konting gigil. Naindip eh. Oo. Oh. <laughs> Kanina kasi natigil niya yung long rally. Oo. Oh. Ito naindip eh. Two serving three. Set number four, folks. Wow. That's an ace. Yeah, that's another ace. Kanina nagka ace na siya sa third yep. set. So USD really just has to communicate with each other. So Eric Paolo Layug just doing very efficient things for De La Salle. It's also surprising the USD Golden Tigers with some of his middle attacks. Pero, yun nga lang, service error. Pressure na ba, nararamdaman? Itong dalawang teams na ito. I would say more pressure here for USD kasi they're yes. down here in this match. Oh, uh, they have to take the set to stay alive in the match. Matita, going magli now. Nagawa ng paraan sa likuran. Ibanez. Here's the Jaws! And a point for USC. G. Boy De Vega very much involved in that play. Yeah, De Vega. Hindi na niya chinalage si Del Pilar one-on-one. -on -one, yung derecho to derecho. Yung kanya, linihis niya yung Jaws niya. Uh -huh. There you go. That won the... That Jaws. Yung pagkalihis. Good serve right there by Ibanez, and then that push, pero Maglino unable to connect. All of a sudden, USD is off to a real good start here. Yeah. 6-3 na for USD. Yeah. 
again. Powerful serve by Josh Ibanez. How about this attack? Net infraction by De Vega. So point goes to LaSalle. Board six. Whoever wins this, there's still going to be a game number two. That's going to be happening this coming Friday. Dito pa rin po sa Paco Arena. And we're left with only two matches to be played, you know? Yes. Yung uh, finals ng uh, women's game two at ganito rin sa men's. So that serve of JM went a little wide. Kaya Puntos goes to uh, UST. But there's more pressure coming from USC. Tanong ko naman for De La Salle after capturing the third set. Trying to really basically do a catch up. And that's why this thing is happening here in set number four. Parang applicable, parang game of spurts. Uh -uh, uh -uh. They can do something very good. Get on a roll for a little while, and then get in the Kalaban. Explosive hit by Josh Ibanez. I mean, the way that he flew when he hit that ball. Look at that. Bokang nagbabadale ang UST, taking us into a technical timeout. Kagad here in set number four. Well, two teams that truly deserve to be here in the finals, and they're showing us and really making it worth our while to get all of our attention. At ito ang Lasalo, mahabul na naman dito. They get the point after the technical timeout. Serving is Natel Pilar. Natel Pilar. Serving six eight. Rainier floor again with that quick attack. It bounces off the blockers. They get the point. Ito na ang UST no talaga yung yung momentum na pupunta na sa kanila talaga and running these plays very interesting plays. Kailangan nila. They still keep themselves in this match. But then Ronquillo happens. The way he attacks it, ang bilis din eh. Ang bilis ng approach, ang bilis ng arm swing. Arm swing, kaya mabilis yung pasok ng bola. It has been happening every time. Para rito sa De La Salle. Grabe rin ito, J.M. Ronquillo. Tama ako, medyo tahimik na nga si Campton eh, di ba? Si Ronquillo na yun eh. This is Josh Ibanez. Sanay na tayo dyan. Gusto mo tulong si G-Boy! Ayun, narinig ka ni Campton. Saan yung sasabihin ko yun, ano? Parang narinig niya ako pala ng mismo, eh, no? Akin na ba? Tahimik ba? So si Campton, he saw the two blockers in front of him. Sarado yung down the line. He went for cross-court. Eight serving nine. Oops. Over received. And that push. And <laughs> Lasa will take the point. Yung mga push na ganon, akala mo, ano ba naman yun, di ba? Pero it's strategic, eh. Into those open zones or to a player na hindi po nakaposisyon. Okay. 
Chibo Indivega is back on the floor here for USD. Tied at nine. Set number four, two one lead for La Salle. Liam Bao. Too wide. Good luck. Kaliwa na ngayon ginamit tuloy ni Joshi Banyas eh. A miss set here by Liam Bao. Sal takes over the lead. Liam Bao going back to Josh. He got blocked. They're still at it. Josh Paren. And it's going to be a point. Double touch. May tatawag against De La Salle. Yeah, twice na touch ni Ronquillo yung bola. He was trying to keep it alive from the hard hit of uh, Ibanez. Palakas ng palo na yun. Double touch na lang kaysa double black eye. <laughs> Combination. Oh, well, Captain. Sabi na siguro, pagpahingin ko nga muna kaya si JM. Ako muna. <laughs> Why not? I have the lead. Yeah, you know, when that set was given to him, he made sure that he went for it down the line. Kasi nga, yung bow is, you know, not as tall as the middle blocker of USD. 11-10. Fourth set. Game one of the finals. Oh, you must get them. Oh, wow. Wow, and then at Titigan Sila. Communication is key to any relationship. They need to regroup. USC calls this timeout. It's 7 2, 7 1 run. I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. I do and what a run here for La Salle. Oh, to the Seven, one run. Yeah. <laughs> Sharp serve. Josh. Ball up. Good save. Nicely done there by Colinares. I don't know if you hesitate. It's like a good one. See, young Bow. Huh? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> well, he quickly got the message from Popo Colinares, so they managed to score. It's Paglino got blocked. It's Paquita. The push for Maglino. G Boy de Vega is right there. Joshi Banyas! Oh, si Josh Ibanez, pag nasa harapan talaga siya, ito, tingnan natin yung replay, no? When he goes for that full arm swing, even if you have two blockers in front of you, pag hindi kayo dikit, at merong konting seam, mahahanap niya yun. Tsaka may wind up, eh, no? Mm. Bago niya hatawin, eh. Doon na pag-iisip yung mga blockers, eh. Saan kaya pupunta? Here he is again. Oh. Oh. J.M. Ronquillo, very rare you see that kind of thing happen with somebody like J.M. Ronquillo. Usually he's already good for it, Chiki, Yeah, 
I think the set was just a little wide for him. He tried to do something, pero very limited na eh, yung pwede mong gawin dun sa wide set. Well, tao rin pala, no? Kumaba pa din. He could do some hang time. There was something, gravity yung kanyang kalaban that time. Pero ito, bawi naman. Pits maglinaw. Maglinaw, very confident in that down-the-line hit of his. Isa lang din ang blocker niya dun eh. So there was a gap between the, that blocker and the antenna. Remember, LaSalle leads 2-1 here for UST. They're trying to keep their chances alive but making a comeback here in game one. And maybe that could also help UST's cause service error like that. So, Eric Lyle knowing like, how important a point is and it's a place here. You know when Josh Ibanyo serves, at mababa yung ano, lipad ng bola, kailangan talaga sundan mo eh, kasi bumabagsak yung bola niya sa dulo. Oh, there's a timeout here by LaSalle. Eh, nangka kasi lagi eh. Nakita mo yung pumipwesto na yung kalaban. Kayo, patayo-tayo pa. Pagpito na pagpito, alam nila hindi kayo handa, babanatan talaga tayo niyan. Sabi ko nga sa'yo, doon lang kayo pumukos. Di ba? Yun lang naman ang na nangyayari, nawawala tayo. Nandun na rin ang gigigil tayo dahil gusto natin bumawi. Pero kaya na naman natin po. Kontrolin lang natin. Kapit, kapit. Ha? Go, go. Isa, isa. Kapit, kapit, kapit. Isa pa, isa pa. Isa! So... Chiki, siyempre, no? Focus. Oo. Kailangan lang talaga concentrate, focus, be on your toes. Laging gumagalaw. Ito, sooner or later, babawi at babawi si Jerem Ronquillo. Parang same spot, okay, nice, and a better set. And I'm going to kill it. I'm going to get that point back. Di na ngayon yung time, Coach John. Mag-ano na tayo, technical timeout. Kapag ng timeout siya, ha? Every point counts. Yes, yun nga yun, eh. Set. She boy gets blocked. Good coverage. Oh, drop speed. Pero bitin. Hey, Josh Ibanez. Look at the reaction of Coach Oji Mamon. Hinayang na hinayang. Parang when you see Josh Ibanez up there going to the attack, parang sure point na yun eh. And he missed on that one. And bow. As the G-Boy de Vega na lang ang kukuha ng point na yan. As we go into a technical timeout here. This is set number four. Who knows what's going to happen next. We'll be right back. Far from over, as they say, but of course, every point counts. That's how it is right now here in set number four. Again, LaSalle is leading two sets to one. And it's a close contest that we're seeing here. It's a very, very painful set that's being played here. Yeah, Florian De Vega knew that, that uh, no, the attack of LaSalle was going to come from Ronquillo. Nabasa nila, kaya na-establish nila ang sarili nila. Wala, hindi nasara nila before that ball could um, enter. 
Popo Colinara, 17-15. Oh! oh. <laughs> Somehow, La Salle, although they lead due to some match NATO in a close one like this. And then the Mataya. Every point counts whether the Uri Naminen or Ibigay Sama. Vince Maglina. Good serve. G Boy. Good dig. And the way on the wall, top door. The heavy kasi yung swing ng arm niya when he hits that ball, sobrang bilis. Tapos may wrist action pa. Look at that. Bam. Pinapunta pa kay Joshi Banyas. Parang idol! Ito rin ginagawa mo sa amin eh. Might as well just return the favor. All tied up at 17. G-Boy naman ang atake. You know, I thought that set was a little close to the net, but not a problem with the Vega. UST again with a good point. They lead by one here. Tedroy with a safe serve. Noel topped on. G Boy again. Off the blockers. Honor recognized ni De Vega eh, na yung blockers ng La Salle, hindi pa sila well established. Pinasok na niya yung bola. Kaya lumabas tuloy, block touch. Uh, not block touch, but off the block. Stretching their lead to just two points. Pero papunta na naman tayo ng home stretch of a set. Oh, well, Canton. Good receive right there by Ted Doroy. Vince Maglino naman. That big and bad off of the bottom UST. Rainier Crow was right there in the middle of that action. Ang ganda ng block ng UST. Synchronized jumps and talagang walang butas. Walang pupuntahan yung bola ng Lasala. Lasala timeout. Magkang magkawa. Hey coach, nilalaban ko lang. Naghihintay lang ako. Alam ko may ko-cover sa akin eh. Ah. Oh. Okay. Okay. natin yung momentum. Pasahan muna natin. Okay? Ah, harap ka na. Ah, harap ako, harap ako. Dali mo dito. Ox, kaya mo dito, dali. Siya. Doon, tapos pa tas. Ah, uh, M, nasa gitna ka? Oh, tara. Dali lang. Target. Oy, oy, oy. Tara, tara, tara. Hey, tara, tara. 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 Sal. You know, after those exes and O's, the main purpose of that timeout is really to stop the momentum of UST. Tingnan natin, ma-affect kaya ang UST. Good. Outside, he served. Aramdam ng pressure. And the Salaman wanting to mount a comeback here. So Gloria, so the specialist, the La Salle. Service. Good guy, huh? Rainer Floor with a good setup job by uh, Yambao. Running back quick and great execution. Yep. My floor. 21 18. G Boy. The Vega. Ano pa ito eh, pwede pang mahabol ng Lasal. Pwede talaga. And UST just needs to control their unforced errors. 19-21. Ox. Oh, net. Called on Lasal. So point goes to UST. Uh, 
So let's see, USD will now have Luigi Yamanaka. Still up, still in play. Josh. I go in the brand and let us sell. JM. You should have listened to Cheeky, guys. That's a fast spelling ball. Let's see now, Bill and Cheeky. It's over. That's it, and I got you. Really? That was costly for LaSalle. But we are good. Why can't I? Okay, I'm going to go to the other side. I'm going to go to the other side. I'm going to go to the other side. It's an easy ball, right? I know. That's it. That's it. That's it. That's it. That's it. That's it. 2023. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. Epo. Wild hand dig. Right there. Good luck. It's going to have an exciting end and conclusion here. Tapos na ba in four sets? Or we'll go the full route. 21-23. Josh Ibanez! Josh, mukhang ano to? Mukhang magpa five sets tayo. Take a look at this yeah. play once again. Josh Ibanez taking us into three sets. Ganda nung play na yun. Serving for the set. That's the bow. That's right there. Vince Maglino. Nagtalakuloko bigla sa USC. Set point save by De La Salle. This is turning out to be a nail biter. Edge of the seat action. Expected the man to, right? Good game. So we go in the full route here. A service error by Dela Sound. And USC takes set number four. 25-22. Expected the man yan talaga. Yeah. In a finals game. Game one tayo. Tabla two sets apiece. You know, ang gaganda ng mga plays na tinawag ni Yambao. I mean, he just really put his hitters in really good positions where they're comfortable in. Kaya pag pinalo nila, talaga namang ang either ang last ng force or talagang nandun sa butas. Well, how do you like that? Truly worth it. Etong laban na ito to consider this is just game one. Pero siempre iba na yung makauna. And we'll have the final set when we come back.
Welcome back, 25-22. Tied a piece. That the galawang set sa magkabila. UST winning set number four. Grabe ito. <laughs> Yung attacks pareho, ang blocks, two points ang nanaig sa UST. Aces pareho, ang errors, one point lang ang, ano, ang difference. And ganyan talaga ka-close ang finals game kapag UST at saka Lasal. Kasi talagang... Diba? Nag-uutakan sila eh. Tsaka yung mga attack, hindi lang mautak yung mga setters, but even the attackers, they don't just hit the ball, they wait for the defense to move, and then they bring in their attack. Sila rin mismo nararamdaman yung pressure eh. Kita mo yung number of errors that they have, 10 and 9 yun ha, marami-rami na rin yun ha. Oo. Oh, oh. Sa bagay, this is uh, after four sets, tapos laging dikit lang. Mm -hmm. Alam mo yun, diba? Yeah. Pero ngayon, because it's fifth set, Ano na to? Shorter. It's only until 15. Until 15. Oo. Oh, oh. Pero kailangan labang ka dalawa. Oo. Oh, oh. Tapos ano pa nga eh, ang sinasabi, di ba, sa statistics, uh -huh. kung sinong unang umabot sa 8, usually siya yung nakakakuha ng set. Aba! So tingnan natin. Tingnan natin. Abangan natin yan, ha? Abangan mm -hmm. natin. That's going to be very interesting. How do you like that? Lasal took the first set. UST taking the second set. Third set, Lasal. UST, ano ba ito? Odd-numbered, even-numbered ba ito? Ganun bang <laughs> sistema nila rito? Eh, set number five na ito. Anything goes here. Mm -hmm. Kumbaga, ito parang 0-0. Parang ganun eh, diba? Uh -huh. Sino manalo dito, will take the match. Nice pa ng ating uh, one of the line spin yung antena. Bugbog na bugbog na itong net na ito eh. <laughs> <laughs> Battle for third ng pinanggalingan. Pagkatapos, yun nga, finals ng women. Eh, alam mo na, kung baga, lalo na sa Battle for third natin, one game affair lang yun. Todo na yun. Oo. Oh, oh. Start of set number five. Eh, dito pa. Ito pa yung concluding schedule na for the for today's game, ha? Eh. Itong men's finals. And UST will serve first. G-Boy De Vega, good serve. Grabe naman. Yeah, alam mo kasi, kakabalik lang ni De Vega eh, to position. Siya nag-serve eh. eh. Ang bilis nung ano, attack nung Lasal. So he wasn't really in position yet to get that. So Lasal breaking the ice here in the final set. Noel Campton. Yamba with that set again. G Boy De Vega. And you gotta love that from Yamba, no? Si talagang binalik niya kay De Vega para to redeem himself. Trying to hit the lights out here, eh? So, oh. Literal. <laughs> Dance Martina going cross good, finding the target. That's the point for Lasal. Iba talaga kapag men's volleyball, no? Ang bilis ng mga bola, ang bilis ng mga pag-iisip. You have to be fast when you're the setter, eh. You think quick. I mean, I had a chance to watch uh, live yung uh, championship in the men's mm -hmm. volleyball sa Asian Games. Wala talaga yung long rally stone. Patay agad. Patay agad. Vince Maglino again took the second points from him. Yeah, and you think, no, na is a set up ni Pokita si Ronquillo, pero no, pumunta siya kay Maglino, and the defense wasn't that ready for that. So, Layo, the serve, 3-1. Fifth and final set. Let's see how this one works out for G-Boy. Combination, Vince McLean out. With a shadow. Joshy Bagas! You got my swag, Nayong! Yeah, she saw that the, uh, she, he saw that the down the line uh, was ano, closed. Kaya ginawa niya, nag-cross court siya. Lusot na lusot ang bola. Zimbao, what a performance yes. he was able to do here for UST. 
Ciampa to go on the baron. Opo Colinares. Pokita. Dennis Marino again. See, Maglino is on a roll. I mean, he has hot hands. Well, it's like he's got three consecutive points oh, here. Okay. Nabigay na sila na mahinga lang ng isang play. Oh, kung hot yung hands ng player mo, sa kanya mo ibalik. Keep using him. It's over. Mm -hmm. Asal again with that point. The attention that these two teams, these two college university teams, they're at it. See it? Josh Ibanez. Yeah, Josh Ibanez. If you need the score for UST, the game was a kanya. Oh, oh. Kasi kahit na merong blockers in front of her, pwede niyang ano eh, pwede niyang iwasan eh. Pwede niyang musutan. Yeah, that combination worked really well for Lasalle because there was only one blocker for Maglinao. Pinagbibidaan ni Vince Maglinao itong ating final set here in Game 1 of the Finals. 6-3. Can imagine, this is 6 points of Lasalle. I think 4, galing kay Maglinao. G-Boy. Oh, good reaction. Yambao, now G-Boy goes for it, he gets blocked. Yambao again, G-Boy, off speed! Oh, there was oh. a net touch yeah. from USD. Now it's still going to be a challenge, one thing's for sure, there is. So a net touch challenge here by USD. Somehow momentum going the way of LaSalle, the way they started here in the final set. Very important challenge here for Coach Oji and UST. It's any indication, five setter and I think game one. Game two. Should be as exciting. S simply saying it. Actually, hindi nga ako makatulog kagabi kasi sobrang ako excited <laughs> manood, panoorin to eh. UST Lasal. Baka naman mamaya, hindi ka pa rin makatulog dahil nire-replay mo pa sa utak mo yung mga pangyayari dito. Net touch ang challenge. Meron nga ba? Oh, oh my God. Meron. Yung chicken wing ni Pukita sumabit sa net. So, good challenge by UST. Yeah, that is a good call. Coach Audrey, oh. So, para para mo siya dalawang challenge. Oo, kasi tama siya eh. Oo. Popoy Culinares, four serving six. Pero teka muna. Are there any more clarifications needed to be addressed here? Gentlemen, there's a challenge by Telesal in the last grade four at Teletouch. So this is how it is dahil nga nasa finals na tayo. Sinagad, the five sets. Uy, meron pa? Antenna touch. Antenna touch. I mean, this match actually, hindi naman ganun karami yung mga challenges, pero right now dumadami na. 
Dito na tayo sa pit set. Understand the feelings and what's going on in the minds of the coaches. Sabi mo, abaka natin kasi na makakauna ng eight points. Oh, usually, ha, usually. Usually. Yellow card. Yellow card. On Coach Oji Mamad. Let's get back into the action. <laughs> okay. Uh, it could mean a lot of things. <laughs> Excessive complaining. Oh. Ball held. Ang tawag dun sa violation na yun. And let's see. Si Pokita na naman. Baliktad. Held, held ball pala. Ang tawag. Noon kasi ang tawag lifting yun. Lifting. Pero ngayon oh, hindi. Held na. ball. Held okay. ball na. Five, six. Popoy Colinares serving. It's the combination. No one can come. Ang bilis nung pasok nung bola. Iyo na naman. Parang tinitingnan na kagad Noel Canto. Sino mga magsusurf? Saan nyo kayo babalik yan? Bago pa siya makaposisyon. Blockers were there, but he was easily able to evade the blockers. 7-5. Natal Pilar with a good serve. G-Boy, the Vega. Very difficult to receive a hit like that kung single hand mo lang itatry, no? Kailangan talaga, ano eh, doble. Dalawang planks. Oh! Ayun na, nakaita agad ang Lasal just because of that service error. Yeah. Anyway, change court lang tayo rito. We are already in set number five. Halu-halu na ito eh. Yung pressure, yung pagod. Oo. Tsaka what you're fighting for. Yes. It's finals na. Tsaka even if this is a best of three, you want to get the first match. Siyempre, siyempre naman. Advantage ka agad yun eh. Ang adjustment nandun na sa kalaban eh. Oo. So, ganun nga ba talaga? 1, 3, 5 for Lasal? Sabi ko nga, ano ito eh, uneven ang dating natin dito eh. The even numbered sets, UST. The odd numbered sets so far, Lasal. Now they lead here in set number 5. 8-6. Blocked by Campton right there. Subok ulit sa kabila naman. Nagawa ng paraan ni G-Boy. Oh, yun nga lang. Hindi napita din ka agad din Hampton. Ito yung USC player na si... Yes, si Rainier Floor. Nalito tuloy si Rainier. Paatake ba ako? Papaluin ko ba ito? Or what? Oh, there's another challenge. From USC. Oh, okay. Ito nga, a five-setter. And everybody, almost everybody's taking a look here. Before we get to show it in view. Nakikasilip na. Ano ba nakikita mo dyan? Katabi ko kasi namin yung challenge system eh. Yes, oh my. Ayan, may touch pala yung challenge. Okay. 
Wal. Uy! Hindi gumalaw. Bakit it's the ball. Oh, sinasabi ni Coach OG, hindi nakuha sa shot. Kung magkano, bakit gumalaw? Yes. So we may have the side. Okay, so they lost out of that challenge. And it's now 9-6. With Paquita to serve for De La Salle. Best side. Josh Ibanez now. Well, it's that, out. Uh -oh, it went wide according to our line judge. So timeout na muna ang UST ngayon. They're going to talk things through. Critic time. Wala ka lamang blocker, ba't kailangan mo pa iwas-iwas yun? Bagay mo na lang ng, sa loob ng court. Double block ba? O. Oh. Hindi ba lang tapos? Ha? Dalawang puntos, eh. ano, isang puntos nila, dalawang puntos natin, aabot tayo dyan. Sana. Dalawa isa. Dito tayo. I think that was a good timeout called by Coach Oji because you have to break the momentum of La Salle because uh -huh. they're on a roll. Dun kasi sa timeout na yun, you know, hardly anything was said except, you know, when when you don't have blockers, siling na kailangan ilihis yung tira mo. And I think he was talking to uh, Ibanez at that time. Well, LaSalle is just five points away to take game number one. And they lead by four against USD. So, dito lalabas yung mindset, no? Yung strength of mind ng USD. Oh, pretty obvious. They're about to try to one, two, three, pero nakamaan yung net. Uh-uh. Because the ball was close to the net, he tried to save it. So mabit lang siya. Just four points to take game one. With Bauer with that set, G Boy gets blocked. Being a to G Boy. And welcome to the Wala nang babalik na bola. Again, a full arm swing from Noel Canton went for the smaller blocker, which was the smart move. Oh. Angas <laughs> bayan. That's a welcome to That push, e boy, no, I can't turn again. Para <laughs> sinasabi, nothing they can do here. Para sinasabi niya, may blockers nga, pero kaya kaya. You are see time out again. Kung nung bitawan, gatasan natin tong laro na to, huh? Pilitin nyo makabawi kayo doon sa mga pagkukulang anina. Pasa muna. Hindi nakahanda. Pasok paghanda. Ay pagpasok handa agad. Hindi naghahanap. Tatanong pa kung saan ang pwesto. Dito ka lang. Dito ka G-Boy. Pagkatapos sa isang action, hindi palit. Dito ka sa kanya. ISD! Kaya pa yan talaga eh. One point at a time. And we just really need to play. Uh, clean, perfect volleyball. At saka most probably for Coach Oji, kung hindi ba nilang makuha ito, huwag mo namang ibigay na lang yung punto. Sa dalawa na lang kailangan mm. lasal. Oh, uh, good point. We have to take it dun sa game two. Oo. Uh -oh. And how we may be able to tie the series and mount a comeback. <laughs> Namahay na si Fox niya sa service area na yan. G-Boy. 
Gawa ng paraan, Vince Paglino, Noel Campton, ayangat yung bola from UST. JM is right there. Binali can see Noel Campton up the block, taking us to match point. Campton dito towards the latter part of this match, talagang nag-iinit siya, no? Siya na nga lahat. Kung kailan kailangan, doon talaga pumasok yung mga puntos niya. I mean, I'm scared for the opponent. Paano ka mag-click? Basically, ito si Ronquillo at saka si Campton. At the same time, uh, in a set. Well, match point saved here by uh, UST. Mm -hmm. This is the coach OG. Sige lang. So, batalo man tayo rito. At least we go down fighting. Yeah. Hindi namimigay na tayo ng points. It's going to be an easy point para sa Lasal. So we take a look at G-Boy De Vega right now. Also played magnificently here in Game 1 for UST. Noel Campton. Attack error there by Campton gives the point to UST. Na-excite yata. Na-over. <laughs> Na-over-excite. Palagay ko yung susunod na setup ni Coquita kay ano na. Kay JM na. Oo. Kasi nasa harapan na rin lang naman si Ronquillo. Hindi, Noel Campton pa rin. Oo, pa rin. Noel Campton pa rin. And that's it. Well, it took all of five sets to settle the issue here in Game 1 of the Finals. But it was truly worth it. The way these two teams started to you know, back and forth, back and forth that we have seen the action here. Yeah. Basta, that conclude ito, unnumbered sets, oh. Lasal. <laughs> Alam mo, ano nga eh, um, your money's worth. You got what your, your money's worth. Totoo. Kasi, Totoo. ang ganda nung, ano, ang ganda nung game from start to finish. Sobrang exciting. Hindi mo alam sino mo nanalo. You know, one heats up and then the other one heats up also. So, talagang, what a ball game. Uh, somebody really played his heart out here in uh, game one yes. of the finals. And of course, baka kasama siya si Amira Almamari as we take a look at this piece of action here. Let's go to you, Amira. Ang kapitan ng Green Spikers, J.M. Ronquillo, congratulations. Kanina narinig ko sa locker room nyo, napakaigay ng music. Can you describe your energy pregame at anong pregame pe pep talk ang nakatulong sa inyo? Um, simula kasi nung nag-semifinals na, ang naging pregame namin is uh, hype songs para makapag-produce ng positive energy namin. Doon pa lang sa locker room. So, yun na dadala naman namin inside the court. In this match, compared sa ibang matches, undeniable na yung connection nyo sa isa't isa. Ano yung instance na nag-push sa inyo para mangyari to? Um, siguro, nag-training kami ng parang talagang para sa championship game talaga. Nung una pa lang na sumali kami sa B-League, parang talagang uh, in-expect namin na talagang ipupush namin makapasok kami ng championship kasi yun naman talaga yung goal ng lahat ng team. Eh. So yun. JM, mga gusto mong batiin? Uh, hello sa mami ko, sa daddy ko, kay Keryl, kay Keman, sa Lasalian community, uh, sana po support niya pa rin po kami. Kay Gibson Balanong and Rafi mga spak, uh, sa girlfriend ko si Lian and kay baby Phoebe, hello. Congratulations once again, JM, back to you, Benji and Chiki. Thank you very much, Kaminsa. Si Amira, pag nagtalang, napapaisip yung mga interview niya. <laughs> <laughs> Dapat lang naman, no? <laughs> Pati ba naman yung music na, eh? Napakaya naman pa yun yung Amira. Well, fantastic sa ball ito. game, diba? Yes, ito yan. Lamang na po ang Lasal, ha? Pero of course, uh, game one pa lamang. Uh -huh. It's, uh, this game is over, pero of course, the war still continues. Yeah, parehong Lasal, no? Ang, Oo ano, nga, ibang klase. Nakapon ng game one. <laughs> well, anyway, it's gonna be happening all on Friday. Game two of the finals, both in the men's and women's division. We hope to see you here back at Paco Arena. So, sa ngala ni Amira Almamari and of course, Chiki Pablo, tanaman po si Benji Santiago. Hope you had a good one. We had a good one. And we'll see you at the ballgame.